Coach, before the game, you had talked about the fact that you liked that guys weren't letting things kind of get away from them against Philly. Kind of happened tonight, but in the ways in which they were able to get back to, say, an eight-point lead and cut that down, what was present, do you think? Um, I think, uh, first of all, we played a really good team. Um, our start of the game, uh, I don't think that we did good enough job of just being logged in and what we need to do and how disruptive we need to be against this type of a team. Um, they got uh, the, the early lead in, in the first quarter, but after that, I thought I thought they really fought for for the rest of the game. And uh, um, at the end, we kept them in the fourth quarter, just scoring 23 points, uh, brought the game back to eight points. What I really like about our guys, they, they never quit during the game. Uh, you know, when they had they had runs, we did not quit. We continued fighting. We we found a way to to, to keep, keep that game close. What do you think it is about their collective mindset that allows them to not shrink in the moment when they do have matchups like this, scouts like this, with the Anthony Edwards, Rudy on that scouting list? It's just uh, taking the challenge on. Like when you play against these type of players, you want to to see where you at. Uh, you know how how much you can compete against this type of talent and what you can learn from it and get better from it. So um, I thought that this was a really good test for us tonight. A career high for Grady as well. Um, what did you like in terms of how he was able to get in flow on offense? Um, his uh, his shooting is well known, uh, but he's finding more ways of scoring. I thought that he was very active. Uh, I thought that the teammates did a good job of finding him when he was open. Um, he just plays with a lot, lot of motor, with a lot of energy, and uh, he had a good game tonight. And I also thought that he, he was really good uh, defensively as well. Um, big time play at the end, towards the end of the game, uh, guarding uh, Anthony Edwards and, and getting that steal, diving on the floor. He did a great job. Yeah, Grady talked about spending some time with Evo on the defensive side of things. How have you seen that progress, and what's your goal for Grady to become a better two-way player? Um, it's it's exactly that. He needs to to work a lot. Uh, that he needs to be uh, on the ball, uh, focused off the ball, to to start recognizing situations for young players. Usually, it takes like two, three, four years for them for the game to slow down, so they can understand personnel, type of actions that they are coming that way, how they can sniff it out, and and be ready to guard those. And uh, he's he's on the pace. He's he's doing a good job, and he's improving on the ball and off the ball. And Ochai, just the energy he was able to provide tonight. How have you seen him evolve since your time with him when he came in last February? Uh, one thing that Ochai is doing a really good job, he's embracing his role uh, of uh, really playing uh, aggressive defensively, to be a really good off-ball cutter, uh, to go for offensive rebounds, to, to do a lot of uh, small things. And then he's just uh, trying to play the right way as well. Uh, you know, when he has open shots, uh, he has a green light to shoot them. Tonight he made three out of five. Uh, I thought overall that he had a good game. Is there any specific feedback that he's asking of you guys in terms of like just ways that he can grow for himself? I mean, we were constantly having conversations with him and with all other players how how to take it to the next level. And one of the most important things is to be everyday guy, to show up and to bring you know to bring the great things to the team every day. And two more for you, Scotty's hands, okay? Yeah. Yes. Um, and then also just the reads that he's been able to make, the passing. How have you seen him kind of step up into that leadership role? And what, have, what does that say about a player like Scotty to have all these new guys in the mix and to still kind of get them going at this point too? Uh, it's, uh, it's a learning uh, process for him. He's uh, learning uh, personnel and teammates that he has around him. Uh, he's trying to figure out uh, the spacing, uh, how he can be effective, but also how to involve his teammates. Uh, I thought that uh, he, he did a really good job in the second half tonight. Uh, uh, first uh, first half, uh, he, he was la lacking a little bit of motor to start the game, but I, I'm really glad that he found it uh, during the game. Thank you. Thank you.